Hey, what is up everybody? My name is Ty, and today we're going to be talking about a new feature that's coming to Dead Island 2 that will please a certain crowd, but also disappoint some others. For a year now, the community has constantly been asking for New Game Plus to come to the game, and well, this might be the closest we're going to get. This is the type of thing that's really for the hardcore players out there, the people that really want to make it extra difficult, and that is the Masochist skill card that's going to be coming in the Sola DLC. With it being a skill card, you can pop it in and take it out whenever you want. And as you're wondering, the big changes are 50% of player instability damage is reduced, making it harder to knock zombies off their feet. Enemy stun is reduced by 70% with 25% slower health regen. And all healing items are 20% less efficient. And the final thing that we know of is all negative effects accumulate 200% faster. All these things come together to create a hard mode experience that I don't know if players will really commit a lot of time into. A lot of these things are just stat changes and I know people really wanted that new game plus experience and I don't know if we're going to get it. From my perspective and how I see it, to make new game plus a thing it does require a lot of progression tweaking. A lot of these story encounters are built around the types of weapons that you have at that point in the story and what's unlocked. Shooting around with guns at the beginning will make things a cakewalk so they would have to rebalance a lot. So much to the point that we probably will never see new game plus and the masochist card is the closest we're gonna get. And don't get me wrong, I do actually think the skill card is a pretty cool inclusion that I do think will appeal to certain types of players. But for anybody out there that looks at the Dead Island Twitter and sees those comments asking for New Game Plus all the time, <laughs> it makes it pretty clear the demand is really high. Like, it's not just a few people asking, the whole comment section is filled all the time with people asking for New Game Plus, and I don't know if we're ever going to get it at this point. Especially after seeing this new card, it feels like kind of a lost cause. And unfortunately, I kind of have to say the same thing with the Neighborhood Watch mode too, which was leaked to be a horde defense mode in Dead Island 2, and it could have been actually really cool. There is a small chance they may bring us future content if DLC 2 or the Steam release does well, but at this point, I just do not know. Share your thoughts about this all down below though and thanks for watching. I do wish we lived in a different reality where Dead Island 2 was super successful, we got all the end game content people have been asking for, and everybody is satisfied, but not this time around and that's just not the reality we live in. Maybe we'll see a lot more with Dead Island 3, time will tell. But anyways, that's enough for me for today. Go watch more TV, go do your thing, and have a nice day everybody. Cheers.